sisters and brothers, yo, listen up, motherfuckers. I unapologetically hope and pray that Allah accepts our struggle. Against the tyrannical white supremacist fascist reigning in the White House as a form of jihad. Did somebody mention jihad? Okay, let's just get some fucking context here. When I am talking about jihad, I am obviously talking about the kind of jihad that our beloved Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam described as the best kind of jihad, motherfucker. All right. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm doing exactly what you said. Look, according to Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, the best jihad is the one in which your horse is slain and your blood is spilled. What the fuck is wrong with you? The best jihad is a word of truth in front of a tyrannical ruler. Bitch! All right. Hey, you know, maybe you should specify which kind of best jihad you mean. Otherwise, people could get confused and start doing things that have nothing to do with Islam, like assassinating the president. Yeah, maybe I could do that. Or maybe you could go fuck your mother. Wait a second. It says here that the best jihad for women is to go on a pilgrimage to Mecca. That doesn't make any sense. Why would the best jihad for women be different from the best jihad for men? Well, shut your mouth and I will fucking explain it to you. Allah has made one sex to excel the other, but Sharia is a girl's best friend. A sister inherits half Worthless than you might have thought Girls can't prostrate while we menstruate So it makes perfect sense in the end That from Allah's perspective We girls are defective Sharia is a girl's best friend To slice off your cleat may seem quite fundamental Sharia is a girl's best friend And sex with your husband need not be consensual Cause you're his to plow Anytime and anyhow Girls are free Theoretically But our freedom will always depend on old man's permission and strict supervision Sharia is a girl's best friend What makes me feel outraged is that motherfuckers be hating on me just because I am a woman that chooses to wear a hijab unapologetically Well, if wearing that scarf on your head is having such a detrimental effect on your life and it's making you the target of abuse and it's preventing you from finding acceptance with people who may otherwise be sympathetic to your cause, then why not just, like, take it off? Okay, let's just get some context to what the fuck is going on here. You're talking about me removing my hijab. Well, how about I come over there and I remove your fucking vagina? Because I will do that. I know a guy. I'll fucking take it away, bitch. Unapologetically. Sharia is a girl's best friend.